customer scoring engines in oracle advanced collections so oracle advanced collections allow you to calculate customer score which can later on be used while dunning letters or in strategy management to determine which dunning letter should be used for which customers or which strategy should be used for which customers a customer score typically represents a customer performance in terms of how good the customer is in making the payments typically the scores will be used in 1 to 100 range wherein 100 would mean an excellent score and 1 would mean a very poor score in payments let us see what are the setups required for calculating the customer score the first one is business level navigate to collections administrator responsibility and go to setup checklist for demo purposes we are going to use customer level click on edit questionnaire and ensure that you have checked the customer business level and click on finish The next ones are scoring components and scoring engine. Let us first understand one of the seeded scoring engines of Oracle. Click on collections method and click on create scoring engine. Type as customer and let us query an existing engine. Customer scoring. Click on update and click on next. This scoring engine calculates a customer score by these three components. The first one is number of delinquencies for the customer. That means how many invoices are pending from the customer which are still not paid after the due date. The second one is customer sins for the customer. That means the date of establishment of customer's organization. and the third one is the total delinquencies amount for the customer so for example a customer having 1 million dollar outstanding could have better performance than a customer having 50 million dollars outstanding amount for each of the components there can be a matrix by which the score can be determined for example let us take customer sins if the customer is established before 1950 then the score value is 100 if the customer's organization is established between 50 to 75 then the score is 70 that means the oldest the customer is the better the score let us see the number of delinquencies for the customer If the delinquencies are five or less, the score is hundred. That means five or less number of invoices are outstanding beyond the due date. The score is hundred. The invoices due are five to twenty, then the score is fifty, and so on. And finally, the total amount which is outstanding beyond the due date. If the zero amount is outstanding, the score is hundred. and for the respective ranges of the amounts respective scores can be assigned once a score is assigned for each component a weight can be applied for that score for example in number of delinquencies for the customer if the score is 100 it will be multiplied by 0.4 that means it will be 40 and accordingly for each component the score will be calculated and then the total of the score will be taken as the customer score if you want to create your own scoring engine first duplicate the existing customer scoring engine give a name demo scoring engine ensure that the engine is enabled click on next you can either change the components or you can keep them the same typically you will configure these as per the requirements of the company 
finish it. Query and see whether your scoring engine appears and see that it is enabled. The scoring components can be created as required by the organization. For example, go to create scoring components, query existing components, the delinquencies amount for the customer, click on it and it is an SQL statement which gives the result for that scoring component. Similarly, the scoring components can be created using the create scoring component button. We have completed scoring components. We have completed scoring engine. Now let us see the transaction flow. First, we should create a customer and enter some transactions. This step has already been created. A demo customer has been created. Let us go to collections agent responsibility. Click on collections. A customer has already been created. Demo industries. And you can see that there are three collectible transactions. Let us see the aging. All the transactions are more than 90 days due. And let us see the transaction. Here you can see the original amount of the transaction, the remaining amount, the days the transactions are outstanding and what were the respective due dates. You will notice that there is no collection score calculated yet and the collection status is current. So the first step has already been completed. The next step is to determine whether the customer is delinquent or current. Delinquent customer means a customer who has a few invoices which are still not paid even after the due dates. Navigate to collections administrator. Click on concurrent requests and request submission. And run a request IEX scoring engine harness. Go to parameters, give the operating unit. And select a scoring engine called delinquency status determination. You can select multiple scoring engines here and select a scoring engine that you have created, that is the demo scoring engine. Click on continue and submit the request. Allow the request to complete normally. Once the request is completed normally, navigate to collections agent. and go to collections workbench again. Select the demo industries. And you will see that the collection status has changed from current to delinquent because there are transactions, there are invoices which are still not paid after the due date by the customer. And the collection score has been calculated. 
This collection score can be used later on by advanced collections module to determine which letter should be sent for this customer as a Dunning letter or which strategy should be used for this customer. So we have completed the determination of delinquency that is the first scoring engine and we also completed the customer scoring that was the second customer scoring engine demo scoring. We have also seen the results that is the collections workbench and the collection score. To know more about 21 volume book set, you can refer to a link given here. Hope this video is useful for you. Thank you. Bye-bye.